we interrupted the oh, right, right, right. Um, so yeah, I listened to it and I was just like, oh my god, this is for me. This is for Starlight. Like, she's talking to me. She's telling me about him, and and you know, and, and it was written at the perfect time because it really was before I, I knew, you know, as much as I do now. Um, um, but I was saying, I love only gets complicated in song. When it comes to music, I see the other side of you. That's like completely different than the, you know, from the sweet Charles that I know from the sweet Charles. And you say that there's another side of you that you're scared to show me, but honestly, I don't think that it's gonna be possible for you to be that way around me because I love you so much. Like I don't think that there's there's enough room for it to flare up because I mean it'll be suppressed, suppressed, suppressed by such a strong force. Like love is strong, baby. Our love is strong. I don't know about anyone else's, but I know that ours is strong enough to do a lot of things, like a lot of crazy shit, and I don't curse, but a lot of crazy shit, you know, and I don't see that as a problem, um, but I do I need you to know, and I know that I shouldn't say this or whatever, but it's on my mind, and I told you I was going to speak my mind, so I'm going to speak my mind, I want you to know that for the longest time I've always wanted to be with this one person like I've been searching for like this one person just one person who'd understand why I love so simply but I love with such intensity and and and, and, and passion that it's like it's almost it almost seems crazy not like stalker you know slasher film crazy but like you know most dudes aren't ready for it like I got the same answer throughout my whole life I've gotten the same answer I'm not ready for this type of thing you know I'm trying to see what's out there blah 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 and it's almost like um I don't want a destination right now I'd rather travel down a few more routes or I'm looking for a fork in the road while I decide which direction I need to go. Am I going to be a jerk or a gentleman? Am I going to be an asshole? Am I going to be, you know, Mr. Chivalry Returns? Like, I just need someone to stand there while I figure out which direction is best for me. And I never wanted to be that kind of girl. I never wanted to be the placeholder, the temp, the temp. You know what I'm saying? I always wanted to be like the, the queen of all hearts. The queen of hearts. There we go. The queen of hearts that just stands at her throne and loves her man and does shit for him that no the female would ever think of doing this the things that I mean just surpasses the definition of what it means to love somebody just freaking knocks it out the book knocks it out as a, as a word and just turns it into this supersonic charged substance that's like I can't even it's intangible like almost intangible but um but um I don't I don't even know if I make sense right now I really don't but yeah yeah maybe I'm thinking too much or maybe I just I love you and I'm I'm tripping over my words or whatever it is. I know you get it. I know you understand me because you just do. You just get me. Get me. Um. And I love you. And I want you to know that I'm here for no other reason but to. And if you can put your arms around me and tell me that you love me and mean it. And if I look, if I can look into your eyes and see that you love me, which just recently happened. Like I can just look at you and see that like not not to say you know I'm breaking you down or I'm wearing you down I sound like Steve Urkel I'm wearing you down baby I'm wearing you down but no I feel like I'm getting through to you like my energy and like my what is it my zen is just fitting into you it's like a glove and I just feel like it shit feels beautiful you know what I mean cause I don't know I just I just want you to understand like it's simple but it's intense and, and most people normal people are not ready for that type of intensity they want it when they're 30 they want it when they're 35 when they're ready to get married when they're ready to have kids when when the biological clock is ticking that's when it comes up that's when they think about it like okay now with somebody who's who's really gonna love me i'm finished playing around but honestly honestly if you find someone like that at 20 years old i think you shouldn't let them go that's what i think and 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 for the reason i was born which is to love and 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 
show people that love can change anything we have planned to do because I believe love can change anything all the what's destined to happen in the world or whatever the shit can change if there's enough love to love there's an, if there's enough love to just you know if we can just change one thing then it's like a domino effect like if you fuck up one thing everything else is just gonna be kind of discombobulated and you know it's not gonna go the way it was meant to go and that's my hope other than you know being in love with you and being happy and sleeping with you every night and holding you and just changing the freaking world with this passion that burns inside me like an undying flame and no one no one I sound like a piece of keys right now no one has ever been able to understand it and even you have trouble understanding that it's just a, this simple need to love this simple, simple need for understanding and acceptance and freaking loyalty and all that stuff like it's it's really that, that's it's one dimensional it's you know step one at least is one dimensional like there's nothing else there's no ulterior motive there's no nothing 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 I just want you next to me at night. I want to breathe your air. I want to be everything that you need me to be. I want to be there for you when no one else is. I want to be your rock. Like, just everything. Anything. I want to live for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't take it the wrong way. Like, I just want to, you know, like, forget about working. I'm just going to follow him around the world and, you know be his personal fan when it's hot and everything as much as I would love to do that I'm not saying that I just mean that I want to be everything that you need me to be you shouldn't want for anything that I can't give to you once again I don't know if I'm making sense I'm tired my stomach hurts and you're so lucky because my cramps began today and by the time you come back they'll be gone and I want you to come back so I can put you to bed and yes I said it I'm gonna put you to bed when you come back I'm gonna freaking love the shit out of you because I miss you so so much I miss you so much baby all right. All right. So I'm gonna wrap it up. I'm wrap it up. Um, 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 once again, I love you. I hope that everything is going perfectly. I hope that you're safe. That you're having a really, really good time. I hope HO is safe. Who else went with y'all? Leroy went with y'all. I hope Leroy is safe. But um, <laughs> I love you. And I'll see you when you come back. All right, bye. Starlight out.